Jesus of Nazareth. I am who you seek. How long do you keep us in doubt? If you are the Christ, tell us plainly. I told you, and you do not believe. The works that I do in my Father's name, they bear witness of me. But you do not believe, because you are not of my sheep. As I told you, my sheep hear my voice, and I know them, and they follow me, and I give them eternal life, and they shall never perish. Neither shall anyone snatch them out of my hand. My Father, who has given them to me, is greater than all, and no one is able to snatch them out of my Father's hand. I and my Father are one. He is calling himself God! Many good works have I shown you from my Father. For which of these works do you stone me? For a good work we do not stone you, but for blasphemy! And because you, being a man, make yourself God! Arrest him! We must get out of here. Quickly! You're president of the Girls' Service Club this year, honey. They won't leave without you. But I need extra time. You know that little girl Maddie I take care of? Yesterday, she said she didn't even want to go to Wonder World Park because she's afraid all the rides will be too scary. I know if I have enough time, I can convince her to come and she'll have fun with me. Uh, that doesn't sound good. Oh, it must be the battery again. You better call Chris. See if the Quantums can give you a ride. What's up? Chris? <sighs> Thank goodness. I need a ride to school. <laughs> on a Saturday? The Girls' Service Club is taking the kids who live at Angel's Rescue on a trip to Wonder World Park for 150 1,000 halfway to the record, school. Chris. And my mom's car broke down. So can you guys give me a ride? But Joy, uh, I'm halfway to the world record for Bogo bounces. Chris, please. <sighs> Chris, you can't stop now. <laughs> the record was almost yours. Sorry, Giz. With all that jumping up and down, my stomach is doing flip-flops. Just hurry, please. No problem. I feel better already. Mock Rocket Mode 3000, Giz! Uh, what is taking them so long? Rizmo, Sky Taxi to the rescue! Thanks, guys! Giz, Mock Rocket Mode 4000! Let's go! Gotta beat that monorail, Giz! No problem! Maybe you're early. Afraid the bus just left. Uh, I was supposed to be on that bus with Maddie. Actually, Maddie missed the bus too. I'm sorry, Maddie. My mom's car broke down. There's still time. Gizmo could take us. If you want to go.
Come on, Maddie. We'll go back home. I know I could have talked her into getting on that bus. If I'd been here. Oh, bad timing. Superbook! I am taking you to meet two women who learned that God's timing is always perfect. Guys, I think we're near the Mount of Olives. You are correct, Joy. According to my geosensors, this is the southeastern slope of the Mount of Olives, to be exact, and we are in the town of Bethany, around the first century AD. Well, come on. Let's see what there is to do around here. Based on my brief scan of the area, there will be olive picking, sheep herding, and, by best estimates, more olive picking, and then some more sheep herding. Oh, Martha. And be sure to make those grape leaves with the fig stuffing I like so much. <laughs> I will make a whole plate just for you, Lazarus. Ah, the both of you are too good to me. Ezra, my friend. Good day, Lazarus. Hello. Oh, oh sorry. <laughs> Let me help. Thank you, child. I'm Joy. This is Chris and Gizmo, and we're kind of new around here. Looks like you're drawing a lot of water today. We have guests arriving. Our good friend Jesus. Jesus? Do you know him? Uh, we're, um, uh, we've seen him uh, around Jerusalem. And we've heard him speak to the crowds. Then come to our home. You may help with the meal, and Jesus will surely <laughs> speak to us. <laughs> Mary, do not impose on the children. I'm certain they would rather be playing than working. No, no, thank you. We'd be happy to come help and to see Jesus. Look there. Travelers are approaching. That is quite a large group. Where do you suppose they're from? Those are not strangers. That is my friend, Jesus, among them. Martha, Mary, Jesus has arrived. Huh. When Jesus was here before, he did not have so many followers. I hope you are not impressed with this false prophet like your friend Lazarus. Ah, uh, certainly not. Though his power must be growing to have so many followers now. This Jesus will never rise to a real prophet. We'll go and meet them. Come on, guys. I am still concerned, Peter. I fear for Jesus' safety more each day. That was a bad situation in the temple with the people trying to stone him. And the crowds keep growing. Yes, the crowds are growing. It's becoming more evident he will soon be king. But this growing popularity also causes concern among certain groups who would like him stopped. We need to do more. He needs to rest, Judas. This stay in Bethany with Lazarus, Martha, and Mary will do us all good. Welcome, Jesus. It is so good to see you. Lazarus, how are you and your sisters? We are well. Come, they cannot wait to see you. Martha, Mary, Jesus has arrived. I think we're gonna need a bigger house. Ow! I'm just saying there are a lot of people. You know, with all these fruits and nuts, I could whip up a Gizmolicious smoothie for all the- uh, No, not now, Giz. Oh. <sighs> oh, here, Martha, let me help you with those. Thank you, child. Huh. I think we almost have everything ready. The bread is baking, the grape leaves are cleaned, and I prepared more of your fig stuffing. Oh, will the lamb be ready on time? Ah, <sighs> so much to do, and she doesn't even offer to help. Well, more hands do make for lighter work. Yes, no, enough. I'm trying to help. I wish Mary felt the same way. But thank you, children, for all you're doing. No. What? If you can believe, all things are possible to him who believes. Lord, doesn't it seem unfair to you that my sister just sits here while I do all the work? Tell her to come and help me. Martha, Martha, 
You are worried and troubled about many things, but one thing is needed, and Mary has chosen that good part, which will not be taken away from her. If you will believe, you will see the glory of God. If they were planning to come out here so Jesus could get away from the crowds, that plan didn't come together too well. Master! Master! What is it? I come with a message from Mary and Martha about their brother. What has happened? Lord, your dear friend is very sick. This time and place, a messenger would only come with this kind of news if someone was near death. <gasps> Lazarus is dying? Lazarus's sickness will not end in death. No, it happened for the glory of God, so that the Son of God will receive glory from this. But we do not know who, even among this crowd, might want to do Jesus harm. I am simply saying, we must all be vigilant for his sake. What's up with you? I keep thinking about Maddie, and if I had just gotten to the bus on time, I would have been able to convince her to go and have a great day at Wonderworld. But I missed the chance. and how Jesus has a chance right now to go do something for Lazarus, but he doesn't. I know Lazarus won't die because Jesus said so, but still, he's very sick and he asked Jesus to come be with him. <sighs> Timing is everything. Now we will go back to Judea. Rabbi, only a few days ago the people in Judea were trying to stone you. And you are going there again? Stone him? Uh, let's not go. Angry people with heavy rocks are always a bad thing. Our friend Lazarus is asleep, and I am going there to wake him up. Lord, if he is asleep, he will get better. Lazarus is dead. I thought Jesus said he wasn't going to die. And I am glad for your sakes that I was not there, that you may believe. Nevertheless, let us go to him. Let us also go, that we may die with him. Uh, die? Whoa, 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 hold on, Chris, Joy, you heard. There are people out to get Jesus and his followers with big stones. Jesus didn't go help his friend before, and he was glad he didn't go. Now he wants everyone to come so they'll understand. I, I know I need help understanding. 
Besides, Gizmo, it's your job to protect us. Ugh. I need a new line of work. Lord, if you had been here, my brother would not have died. Yet even now, I know that God will do anything you ask. Your brother will live again. I know that he will rise again in the resurrection at the last day. I am the resurrection and the life. He who believes in me, though he may die, he shall live. And whoever lives and believes in me shall never die. Do you believe this? Yes, Lord. I believe that you are the Christ, the Son of God who has come into the world. Where is your sister Mary? Please bring her to me. My brother would not have died. <laughs> Where have you put his body? Lord, come and you will see. See how much he loved Lazarus. He gives sight to the blind. Why couldn't he have kept Lazarus from dying? We must roll the stone away. Lazarus has been dead four days. There will be a bad smell. Did I not say to you that if you would believe, you would see the glory of God? Jesus has performed miracles before, but raising someone from the dead? That's impossible. Father, I thank you for answering my prayer. I know that you always answer my prayers. But I said this so that the people here would believe that you sent me. Lazarus, come forth! Perform such miracles as truly the Messiah. And 
and I thought he came here too late to help Lazarus. We are back. Now, are you ready to break the world's record, Chris? Yeah. What's up, Joy? Superbook said God's timing is always perfect. So maybe there's a reason I didn't make it to the bus in time to try and convince Maddie to go to Wonder World. But what would that reason be, Joy? Wonder World is great! Maybe I wasn't meant to get Maddie on that bus. Maybe I was meant to spend time with her doing something she'd like even better. <laughs> Hang on tight! Oh, yeah! I've never seen her so happy. She usually just sits by herself. See? This is better than Wonder World Park. This is Maddie's very own park. Chris, this could be your chance to set the world pogo stick record! I don't think I have much choice. Maddie's never gonna let me stop! God's timing is perfect. They reported that Jesus raised Lazarus from the dead. This man is working many miracles. If we don't stop him now, If we let him alone like this, everyone will believe in him, and the Romans will come and take both our place and nation. You know nothing at all. Nor do you consider that it is expedient for us that one man should die for the people and not that the whole nation should perish. From that day forward, they plotted to kill Jesus.
It's the new Superbook Bible app. <laughs> it's packed with games, activities, and Superbook episodes that you can watch for free. Oh, no! There's trivia, a fun daily devotional, and answers to your Bible questions. Plus, an easy-to-understand Bible the whole family will enjoy. You can even create your own Superbook character. Ta-da! It's the new Superbook Bible app. Free downloads on iTunes, Google Play, and Amazon.